Ethaprol. Chemical class and types. Ethaprol belongs to the chemical class of phenylpyrazoles and is categorized as a broad spectrum insecticide. Uses Ethaprol is widely used in agriculture to control pests such as rice hoppers, leaf hoppers, and plant hoppers in crops like rice, sugarcane, and cotton. In horticulture, it protects ornamental plants and turf against a variety of insect pests. It is also effective at low application rates against plant hoppers, thrips, aphids, weevils, flies, and maggots, grasshoppers, psyllids, leaf miners, and some species of whitefly. Additionally, it's sometimes used in public health programs to manage insect-borne diseases. Mode of action. Ethaprol acts as a non-competitive blocker of the gamma-aminobutyric acid, or GABA, receptor. This interference disrupts the normal functioning of the nervous system in insects, leading to hyperexcitation, paralysis, and ultimately, death. Formulation. Ethaprol is available in various formulations, including granules, suspension concentrates, wettable powders, emulsifiable concentrates, and baits. Dose. The recommended dose of Ethaprol varies based on the specific crop and target pest. For rice, the typical rate is a 100 to 150 grams of active ingredient per hectare. For sugarcane, it ranges from 150 to 200 grams per hectare, while for cotton, it's usually 100 to 150 grams per hectare. For ornamental plants, a solution of 0.5 to 1 gram of active ingredient per liter of water is commonly used. Always refer to the manufacturer's label for specific application rates and instructions tailored to local regulations and pest pressures. Thank you for watching our video on Pesticide Info. Remember, when using pesticides, it's crucial to follow the recommended dosage and guidelines provided by the manufacturer. Always read the label carefully and use the product as directed to ensure effective and safe pest control. Always wear protective gear. Stay safe and protect your crops responsibly. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave a comment below.